You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Emily Trinikowski. Stanley Black & Decker announced a first quarter EPS of $1.08 X items, beating the consensus estimate for $1 and a penny per share. Revenue for the quarter was up 9% year over year to $2.38 billion, just above the consensus estimate for $2.36 billion. The company now sees a 2011 EPS of $5 to $5.25 versus the current consensus estimate for $4.94 due to a favorable tax rate. Stanley Black & Decker's President and CEO John Lundgren commented, We remain enthusiastic about the prospects that 2011 holds for Stanley Black & Decker and feel confident we started the year in good stead. March 12th marked the one-year anniversary of the Stanley Black & Decker combination. We are pleased with how the integration has progressed so far and are reiterating that the continuation of this success remains our top priority. As previously stated, our cost synergies are forecasted to be an annualized rate of $460 million as we enter 2013, up from our original forecast of $350 million. For more updates, stay tuned to the Financial News Network. I'm Emily Trunikowski.